In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how you can add a new number in iMessage or FaceTime on your iPhone. This will also work with other Apple devices. Uh, it will be a similar process, but maybe things will be in different locations. So first of all, what we need to do is we need to go ahead onto our phone uh, or other Apple product and we need to click on the settings tab. Now the settings is like a little cog, it's grey and it says settings below it. Once we've clicked on that, we're going to open up the settings window and we basically need to scroll down until we see the FaceTime option. So you can see below messages it says FaceTime, it's a little green icon with like a white camera in the middle. Now once you're on here, you're going to see a section that says you can be reached by FaceTime at. And there it's going to give you the options that you have. So for me it has my phone number and it also has my Apple ID email. Now below that there's going to be a little section that says Apple ID and then inside that there's going to be your email in blue. What you need to do is go ahead and tap on that email in blue and it's going to give you the options to sign out. What you want to go ahead and do is sign out of that and then you're going to have to go ahead and sign back in with the new Apple ID which you're going to be using for the FaceTime or iMessage. So this can be an Apple ID that's associated to a phone number or one that's associated to an email, or maybe it's associated to both, depending on what you want to do. But basically, go ahead and sign in with that. Uh, it might take a second to update on your FaceTime and everything. You might have to restart your device. But after that, it should be done and ready to go. So if you enjoyed the video and found it useful, be sure to like and subscribe. Comment down below that it helped, and I'll see you in the next one.